driving of the ball has never really been my strong point up until the straight fit uh, you know came into play here for us with the technology you can really you can really dial your driver in being able to to you know change the the lie angle and and uh, um, which effectively changes the loft of the golf club is just amazing to me. What's the most loft you can get out of this and what's the least? So you got plus or minus two degrees that you can run the loft up and down. And two degrees for, for a golfer, especially a high swing speed, I mean that's the world, right? It, it two degrees should. is the world. If I know the wind's going to be blowing 20 miles an hour, 30 miles an hour, then, then um, uh, I, I might take a little loft off the club by opening it up can do it the same way if I know it's going to be a very wet week where I need to hit the ball up in the air more. Um, close the face a little bit to add some loft. Play in a place like the British Open where you need a low shot, a lot of roll, take the loft off. Well, what if a guy goes and works on a swing and he develops a, you know, a better swing? Well, there's a, you know, if his swing changes, there's probably another setting inside those 8 or those 32 that allows him with a good inside path to, you know, to hit it better when before he might have been coming at it from a different place. And so it, it makes the clubs more versatile throughout the life of the driver. So we'll go a little more upright to try to get the launch angle up. Mm -hmm. well, that's what we're talking about. See, that's the beauty of what we're able to do here. By the end of the day, you're going to be completely dialed in like we are. It's eye-opening. <laughs> I mean, who would... How do you think of this stuff? <laughs> it's, you know...